Hey guys, what's going on? It's Kyle here at Formality Gamers, and today I've decided to bring back a good old series of mine, one that I thoroughly enjoyed, and I'm pretty sure you guys did too. But this is City, City, City Skylines, episode 15. Now, I would be already loaded in the city, cracking on. Getting on with everything, building the city up. But we ran into a very hectic problem. And it's one that kept happening and kept happening. But after a fresh install, fresh install of all the mods, all the assets, and everything else, I think everything's all good now. But the consequences of the actions was I have to start a brand new fucking city again. But this time I got good hopes, I got good hopes but because I've downloaded a new city I thought, do you know what new city, new map and I couldn't help but go for this one because this guy is just like the great plan made for builders, it's just I love. I just love it, I love the sound of it, I just look at the natural resources that are there, it's got a fair amount of water, it's got all connections which is good so any... Do you know what? Let's let's use that. So, what shall we call this? Do you know what? This is something that Luke suggested to me. So, shout out to Luke. SWAT City. Let's get on with this city. Also, guys, just to let you know that I've started because I've got an Nvidia graphics card now, uh, Nvidia 660 Ti. I'm actually able to use shadow play which means I should have amazing performance and my recording should not affect my frame weight frame weight my god what's what's going on with my words my frame rates as harshly as audio of the program so fingers crossed it runs smooth it runs steady and it still takes ages to fucking map thing City Skylines needs to improve like apart from it's a CPU intensive game it needs to improve its loading times. I know it's a custom theme map and it's got a custom template on it and all this, that and the other, but it still shouldn't take this long. I'm about 3-4 minutes into recording right now and about 30 seconds, 40 seconds of that was just the loading screen. But anyways guys, before I jump right into the actual gameplay, because it just goes really loud and it floods me up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. This is not well they could come round here. Yeah I suppose Okay, this guy's How are you how are you meant to do that? How right, okay, so yeah, we'll get rid of this because I don't know what's causing that. So if we Go to TI and just build a quick road there so we lock our other roads and we lock up. So if we get this right, oh, okay, it's just down the stream. That's okay because I thought it would have came up and then down the stream. I thought we were going to have a problem. But it's all good. So, as I was saying, we've got some plans here at Formally Gamers. And I know you hear this a lot oh, we've got plans, yeah, we're going to do this, that, and the other, and we don't follow through. But we've got some plans, I'm not going to make any promises like, but Luke's going to bring out, maybe, we're just still discussing it, that's why it might happen, it might not. But we are discussing about bringing out some Black Ops, the classical Black Ops, because that's just got accepted onto, accepted, it's, it's just got onto Xbox One, and of course Luke's running an Xbox One, he still might play on 360, I don't know, but he's going to be using my account. Uh, for prestige and road to 15 for prestige so that's something to look out for now we don't really know the latest with Jordan at the moment because Jordan is a very 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 busy guy at the moment and I'm not saying me and Lou can't but Jordan's got like three different jobs that he has to attend to and he's got all of his other like life priorities at the moment which we can't really blame him for so we'll just have to see what happens with Jordan. We're going to have a 
discussion with him about what he can obviously do for you guys because I know that a lot of you guys were enjoying his Last of Us so we'll have to see about that but apart from that let's get on with City Skylines now this custom map never seen something like this before it's like quite tricky like do I start off going over here or over here thing is if I start over here I'm going to be like digging into this area around here where to start off with maybe not it might not be ideal but I am considering starting over here because I have got some custom intersections which I cannot use at the moment because I need some levels which ain't good I need levels for these oh, oh do you know what wouldn't hurt using a quick roundabout right about what then I can say in that do you know what we will have to make our own roundabout if I can remember how to do these things my god right oh and our roads united to actually finally working as well which is a bonus right How are we going to do this then? So I oh know if we do this and then do that, we can say if we go to five. He's got no nah. no traffic lights. That's good. That's good. What we could also do is well let's make it a smooth transition going from. So if we go to five, let's say. already occupied. This is one thing that I did not miss about six skylines. About to go to seven. Okay, we'll go to about four then. We'll go to four. Nice angle land. We'll go to fifteen. There we go, that's alright. Can't complain about that. So four, we'll go to about fifty. There we go. Do you know what? I'm happy with that. So, what I plan on doing over here is this section over here is going to be my industrial, where I'm going to start all my industrial stuff. And this section over here is obviously going to be my residential. Now, I'm going to make sure these two areas, this, these two districts, whatever you want to call them, areas, are going to be joined up by this roundabout. And I'm going to make sure they're quite close to the roundabout, obviously, because if you build the houses too far away, then they obviously won't go to work, and then that's not going to be very... Ah, oh, that's... What's confused that one? What's going on? Right. That's all good. Okay, right. Now, we have to... parts from here too. Right. See if that's the center we need to go into about eight lean road. Jesus Christ, look how big that that's massive. Right, okay. 
So if this is a three lane, we theoretically want a three lane coming off it as well. So if we have a three lane, we're just coming over here for now. have that coming off at about I think 60 degrees is quite good. But I want it shorter. So we'll come to about 565 degrees, that looks decent. Now we want it about 65 degrees as well this side. Well we can't get 65 degrees so I'm gonna have to That's about right. Okay. No one goes in this one. Look at that. There we go. I've never done that before. There we go. Oh, oh no. Do you say there's a back button? No. My god, what the fuck did I do that? I'm, I'm just trying to get back. I'm just trying to get used to all the keys again, guys. That's what it is. That's my problem. But I just faked it out. Right, how do I do this? I've already forgot how I do it. How I do this. Right, I know it was like 60 degrees. 65 degrees. Right. This is not going well. Right, um... That's where I went wrong. That's there we go. Okay. So now we want to start building off our traffic. Yeah. Build that road too far. What's going on? What's going on? I'm going to have to be happy with that. Because I don't think I'm going to be able to do much better than that. But Oh well. So, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring... We'll go to about three. Three to three to three. Three to three. There we go. Now, they can obviously go around if they need be. But I am going to. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to put an electrical plant right here. And then they can just come out and not cause any stress to any other citizens of SWAT City. Right, so. We're coming quite close to the edge as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build off... Budget's alright. A nice little 
red. There we go. Right, so this part's going to be my industrial area. Quite like that. Well, I might have this side my industrial, and then this side my houses. And stuff. Well, I don't know. Just, just going through this pain again. Don't get that snap on this side. Otherwise, that one would be pretty damn amazing. Same, but this part's for the residential, so it's not too bad. Sorry for hardly speaking, then, guys. I was just too busy focusing on trying to get the right angles and stuff. It's just a pain in the ass this game sometimes, especially when the snapping's not working how I like it to. So it's trying to get the angles right and everything like that because I am a bit of an OCD type of person, but the fact that I have to accept that. <coughs> I won't be able to get this roundabout exactly the same on both sides because roundabouts on seat skylines isn't really my forte. Let's just pull it that way. I can't do them to save my life, but that's why I've got the assets, but I can't use any of them, so oh, I'm just going to deal with it, really. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to do the same thing as I did on the other side. I'm going to Five, five, there we go, nice roundabout turn. What are you doing now? Ah, there we go, that was what was wrong. And off this side. I'm going to do the basic grid method for now because we need a lot of coverage for residential. And obviously shock coverage as well. So what we'll do now before we get 
absolutely crazy because I know this costs like 19,000. Ooh, this is going to burn a hole. Ooh. Right, I need to get the pipes over to here. I think I might have overdone myself, you know, guys. Yeah, I think I've overdone myself. Yeah, I can. We'll expand on that. Don't worry. Don't worry. We'll expand on that. But what we need to do for now is we need to make sure we get power over to this side. We get power to over to these pumps. Not the neatest pipe work, but I'll take it. So, we'll do all this residential, apart from, because obviously I need room to expand, so we'll get rid of three on each side, because then we can bring out the road. You know what, I might even get away with just, just to be on the safe side. <coughs> so we've got the water work, coverage, we've got electricals where does my zoning come to? I might bring this power line to here just in case, just to be on the safe side got 1.2 thousand spare we'll knock our budget down all the way all the way and let's see what happens so we've got our first houses being built. That's good, good stuff, good stuff. Why not just go all out? Why not go all out? There we go. We're already, we're already getting high demand for shops. Okay, okay. Right, let's build some shops there. Um, build some shops in the here. I'll build some along here as well. A lot of demand for shops, jeez. Industrial buildings, so we'll just go mad and place them all here. Because I might expand over here. I might. Do you know what? Yeah, we'll get rid of these two spaces here. Start to go into the profit zone, that's good stuff. There we go. Our demand has gone right down, starting to make some money again. Some good stuff that is. So, I need to figure out the free camp. See, I've just forgot, I've forgotten all the keys and everything. All the shortcuts. I'll quickly look at that now. Right. Gameplay key mapping. Zoom camera at free camera mode. Free camera mode. None. Pretty sure there is a button for it, default, like, but... 
Rotate, pan camera, pan camera left, build elevation up. That's space. Uh, in game. Here we go, in game. Pause simulation, normal. Select zone in. Unique. Uh, select, 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 select. I don't want to select anything. I don't want to select. City so info, login panel, advisor panel, create, D zone, zero, select info, crime info, health info, density, pollution, natural resources, landfill, outside, traffic, wind speed, garbage, levels, fire safety. Okay, there's nothing about camera. Unless I've completely missed it, knowing me, I probably have. So I'll have to do a quick. Google search on that. But anyways guys, I'll end it there with the obviously simulation playing. But our city is coming along quite well. It's already starting to make some money back, but the demand's going up, so hopefully I'll get my money back before I build more roads. Really need to build more roads. So I can expand my city. Yeah. Ooh, it's not good. Man. But anyways guys, I think I'm going to leave it there for this episode. The great return of City Skylines. The one you guys have been waiting for. But, I'm sorry I was quiet for most of the video. It was just pure concentration. Trying to do something good with the roundabout. Which really failed in the end anyway. So, it was just not good. But what we might have to do is we might have to rebuild this later on. We'll just have to like replace it completely and then fix these roads. So I'm going to try not to do much around these areas again. I know I've built some shops, but they can get knocked They can get knocked down. So I'm going to pause it there so I don't start losing money because I'm getting high demand for houses now. But anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And I will be carrying on with these videos because obviously I've brought it back now. I can't just like make this one video and then just fuck off again. Even though we have got a bad habit here at Formality Games doing. But I promise you guys I am going to be carrying on with City Skylines. Because I am enjoying it. And this is quite a nice little start to the city. So I'm going to have to think of what I want to do next. Where I want to take it next. Because this map is actually really good for opportunities. Not God, I built that on the slant. That's so bad. But adds variety. Just imagine it all blocking the grid. But anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.